Hello and welcome to another do-it-all-yourself guy video. Today we're going to have a quick informational video. I have a new Asus motherboard that I have purchased for my upcoming PC building project. I know this motherboard is capable of the 14th generation Intel processors. However, I do know that some of these motherboards have been sitting on shelves in stores for quite some time. So I know that the BIOS, the basic input output system of this motherboard is likely outdated. In order to find out the loaded BIOS version that came on this board out of the factory, there's one easy way to do it with Asus motherboards. They do a really cool thing. If you look at the motherboard right here in between the processor socket and the memory, there is a sticker right here. This has the information you need. The last four digits on this sticker is the loaded BIOS version that came out of the factory. So you can use this information to figure out what, what version of BIOS is loaded on this board without having to even bring the motherboard out of the box. You don't have to power it on, you have to install anything. But this is very important information because this tells you if the motherboard as is out of the factory is capable of supporting the 14th generation Intel processors or not. So here's the motherboard. I'm gonna zoom in between the CPU socket and where you install the RAM. Right here, this sticker. As you can see, here's the data. So the last four digits in my case is 0812. So the loaded BIOS version on this motherboard out of the factory is version 0812. It's worth mentioning that this feature is common to most Asus motherboards, newer ones, where you can find out the BIOS version without having to power up the board itself. So I really like this feature because in my case, I have to know what the version of the BIOS is out of the factory because that determines whether this board as is is able to support my Intel i7 14th generation processor that I purchased for this. And in my case, it appears that I have an older BIOS. So I will have to upgrade the BIOS on this board in order to get my new processor to work with it. I'll leave a link below for the video that shows details of how to update the BIOS on this board in order to have it support the 14th gen Intel processors. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.